Hello and welcome to the video for what is UMG. UMG or Unreal Motion Graphics is the tool inside of Unreal Engine 4 that is used to create user interfaces as well as other interactable objects. If you'd like to create a UMG item, you can right click, go up to user interface, widget blueprint, and name your widget. This will then allow you to open up the widget interface where you can do your editing. On the left we have our palette which has all of our widgets that come supplied with Unreal Engine 4 such as a button, checkbox, an image, some control widgets such as canvas panels, scroll boxes, and things like that. After you have a widget, it goes down into your hierarchy. This is where you can create your actual layout. Here you can see my startup panel, which has a text box, a text box, and a button with start on it. You can have multiple layouts and multiple panels, and you can customize it to your choice. You also have the ability to create animations with the timeline editor below, but that is covered in another video. For our example, you can see our labels and a start button that waits for me to start. I cannot move and cannot do anything else in the game. I hit start, I now have full control of my character. I have an ammo readout, a life readout, and a little icon on the bottom showing I'm a commander. If I resize the window, you will notice it resizes and the elements stick to where I have told them to stay. This is a handy feature of UMG. Another one is 3D widgets. Here you can see a life bar that is attached to the top of a skeletal mesh that we could adjust if we chose to code. You can do other things such as maybe pop-up hints and things like that in 3D space. We also have our pause menu. Hitting P pulls up our pause menu and I no longer have control of the game. I have a quit button and a make it awesome button. Unfortunately the make it awesome button is not hooked up. That will be up to you. But if I hit quit it returns me to the editor as I have quit the game. UMG is a very powerful tool that lets you do user interface elements as well as other common interactions and things you may wish to visually see inside of your game. There are other tutorials covering each widget that comes supplied with Unreal 4.